All right, home maintenance, home maintenance here again, getting ready to do another job. We're actually pressure washing this entire driveway to make it look new again, and also we're, we're uh, uh, doing some work on the cracks. Here's the area right here that we're going to basically cut out and replace this area right here. You can see it's broken up, but there's all kinds of cracks on the job too. Right through here is a major crack. You can look at this. Come on down a little bit closer. All this right here. There are some major cracks all through here and uh, little places like this. You can see where it's actually coming up loose. So uh, come over here, I'll show you some more stuff. There's all kinds of different places out through here. Uh, here's an area that uh, Scott's already done chiseled these out, that's my son. And, what, and then we're gonna, pre we're gonna press wash it. You can see, see how dirty this is and see how clean this is? Well, we've already done clean this area. area. We're getting ready to get back up here and clean this. And here's another area, you can see how dirty it is. If you ever need if you ever see, see the tunnel, see the difference, see how dirty this is, how clean this is, we're getting ready to finish this. Now, if you ever need uh, anybody to pressure wash and clean your driveway, uh, we, we clean uh, uh, homes, houses, we clean everything that has to do with pressure washing. We can clean your driveway, make, make it look brand new. You can see there's a big difference right there. So if you ever need any pressure washing, any driveway cracks, uh, work done on those, we do those a lot. So what we're doing is we're basically pressure washing, cleaning everything, and we're doing these cracks on this driveway. So repairsforyourhome.com is where you need to go to. I'm Steve Reed. We're going to show you some more pictures, that, uh, videos as we're working on this job, and then we're going to do a, a final video. So we do all kinds of work to driveways. Uh, at the entrance of this man's house, we're going to cut out a big section of concrete and, and report it back to you. But right now, we're just in the process and wanted to you to see kind of the video of how we're doing this so you can kind of get a, uh, an idea that if you need this type of work, we want you to see how, what it looks like so we can improve your home too. So there's a big difference. This tool right here does it all. This thing right here, this little tool right here, it does a real good clean. So, and you can see the difference. Also, we've cleaned this sidewalk too. We've already done cleaning the sidewalk. Sidewalk goes all the way down, and so we've done the sidewalk, and now we're getting ready to go do this area right here. Clean it, then we're doing all the cracks. But anyway, if you ever need this work done, go to repairsforyourhome.com. Thank you very much, and goodbye. All right, everything's looking good now. We're we're going a lot. Uh, we're getting a lot more done. As you can see, this part right here has not been done, but this part right here has. So what we've done is, is we've cleaned all of the driveway. All the way through here, so come on, I'll show you what it looks like. Right now, there was a section of concrete that, that was broken right here. It's real common because when something splits off, it can break right there. So Scott's in here cleaning it out now. Once we clean this excess out, we're going to drill holes in there and we're going to put some rebar in it. Here's our rebar. So just imagine that this rebar is drilled in here and, and, and down inside this, and then we're going to pour it. You see this crack right here we've got cleaned out? That crack was pretty much already there. It's a pretty big crack. All these places like this, we're going to fill these in. All these places, there's all kinds of cracks in here. We'll get to fill them in. You can see there's some obvious ones. See this crack right here? All these cracks are going to be filled in. That's just where they didn't do nothing special to us. All this has been cleaned. See that crack right there? Now, what I want you to, to notice is that when you look at this gigantic big area right here, there's one expansion joint in here. This is a straight line. This is called expansion joint. But this whole entire area right here, there's not one expansion joint in. Matter of fact, come back this way and look at this whole entire area. From this expansion joint right here to this expansion joint, there's not one expansion joint split in here anywhere. So that's why it's broken. So if you hire our company to come pour some concrete for you, we will not neglect this. We will put expansion joints every 12 feet apart. And the reason why is because concrete moves. And it will crack if, it, if it's not uh, done properly. So what we're going to do is, if you hire us, we know what we're doing. We cut expansion joints in it in squares. 
So when it moves, it won't look like this. So now what we're getting ready to do is fill all these cracks in. We've got it all clean. Here's one of our tools that we use to clean it with. Here's another area that's, that I've actually got this loose material out right here. Right through here, we're going to fill this in. See right through here? It's pretty bad right there. So all that right there is going to be filled in. So we're doing a, gen we're doing a really good job for the people and it even goes that way right there. Real common stuff, just, just stuff that we notice all the time. So we're going to show you some uh, another video, you know, after we get through doing this and that way you can see how it looks when it's filled in. But uh, we do this all the time. Check out all of our videos on the internet. Go to repairsforyourhome.com and just look at everything that we do. And you might need some of the work that we do. And we want you to call us. Until then, just check, keep, keep looking at our videos and watching our work. And we're hoping that we've impressed you by what we can do because we know what we're doing. Steve Reed, just letting you know, we appreciate you watching all of our work. And we want you to just to call us so we can go help you. Thank you so much. All right, now we're, we've already put uh, this material that we use in the cracks. And come on, I'll show you what it looks like. What we do once we put it in the crack, we take a sponge. And what we do is, is we go around and around with the sponge. What it does is it smooths out the job. It actually makes it smoother. And you can see as I'm going around and around, it's dressing it up. And it's making a whole lot smoother, see? The rest of them haven't been done, but that one right there has been done. Now that's how we do it. And as you can see, if you ever have any problems where you got some cracks, we want you to get in touch with us because we can help you. But how that right there has been sponge, after that dries, it'll be lighter right now. It's a little bit darker color but it'll lighten up and blend in more with the driveway. So, if you ever have any need of this and you need some work, we want you to give us a call or go to, <coughs> excuse me, go to repairsforyourhome.com. Thank you so much. All right, we're back and we've done some awesome work. We've actually finished the job. So I just want to show you a little bit. This is kind of the final, uh, uh, well, basically the rest of it. Well, what I mean by that is this whole piece of concrete slab right here, had dropped. And what we done was, was we beveled that out, kind of got that at an angle where nobody would trip. Also, we got all these cracks right here. Now then when this lightens up, it'll look a whole lot better. Now, all the driveway's been cleaned. We've got every one of these cracks also up here too. We've got all these cracks up here too. Every one of these. And all these cracks up here. Now there was a bunch of them. Now when this dries, you can see there's a bunch of them up through here. But when it dries, it'll, light, it'll blend in because, see, we pressed wash to clean the whole entire driveway. Come on, show you some more stuff. Right through here, there's a trip hazard. And what we done was we tapered that so nobody would trip on the sidewalk because everybody walks through here. There was one right there. There's another one right here. When, we, when that dries, it'll blend in, plus nobody will trip and fall. All this through here. Also, brick repair, too. If you ever need a brick repair, look at this right here. Now, there was a bad split right there. We've got that filled in. When that dries, that'll blend in. Come on, show you some more stuff. Now, this is a beautiful place here. Come on, we'll show you some more stuff we've done. Come on, look at this. Good pressure marks in the entire driveway. Here's some more cracks up here that we've done. Just kind of looking at it that way. Right here, we've done all we've done all that. There was a piece right here that was broken. We, we took it out and we poured concrete right here. So this is the entire driveway. This driveway looks so much better than the way it looked this morning. It's unbelievable. Come on down here, and I'm going to show you. There's an area down here we're going to take out a big section of concrete work 
tomorrow section with my tractor. We're gonna tear it out. We're gonna put it in this dumpster. Come on, I'll show you what it looks like. Now we love working for people who love companies that do good work, and we're one of them. I know there's another company. There's other people out there that do good work, and I. But I believe right now some of the stuff I'm showing you. I believe even our our competitors love our work. I really do believe that. More sex, more sex. Well, go ahead and hook the fresh wash up in the gun. Let's read, let's work, let's read this right here down real quick. Now we got to uh, take the, the pressure washer and do a little bit more right here and clean this off. And I'm going to show you the section we're going to tear out in the morning and replace it. The section that we're going to do is from, from right here, this whole entire area right here. All this is going to be taken out with the tractor before we look at this. So come right here and look back this way so they can see it. This is the beginning of the driveway. And right here at the beginning of the driveway, over time, it's just deteriorating. You can see it. See where it's just crumbling? All this whole area right here is crumbling. What we're going to do is we're going to take, we're going to, there's the dumpster right there. We're going to put it in this dumpster with my tractor and uh, haul it off tomorrow. This whole area is going to be taken up, and we're going to re-pour this whole area tomorrow. Just want you to see what it looks like right now. Now, we never did clean this because we're going to take it up. And you can see where we stopped cleaning. Come here and show this to them. The reason why we cleaned the driveway is so it'll match with the new. Now, all this right here stays this way. All this... All this stays this way. Every bit of this is going to stay, remain this way, but we're going to take this section out. So if you need some concrete done, you got a bad driveway, go to repairsforyourhome.com. Look at all of our work and, and uh, look on there. You'll see all the cities we work in. You'll see the telephone numbers. Call us because we want to work for you. I'm Steve Reed. We appreciate you so much looking at all of our videos, and we hope that you and pray that you call us. Thank you very, very much, and goodbye. What's up, everybody? This is Float Daddy out here with uh, Mr. Steve Reed. We, we are back out here on this job on the driveway and uh, I'm going to show you what, what the boss man is doing over here. He's over here in the tractor and he is tearing some stuff up right now. You should see we got this driveway coming out. There's Mr. Reed right there. Scott, the Vice President JoJo. You see, we got a big chunk of it already taken out. I tell you, that tractor does a lot of work. Helps the back. I'm here to tell you. What do you think about it, Scott? What do you think about it, Vice President? All right. Vice President gives a thumbs up. So we're absolutely doing good. Show you a little bit of this right here.
every now and then a little, little hard labor has to come in. Uh, we back guys. I want to show you a little more of uh, what we got done here We're almost done. I mean, we've got just a little bit in that corner right there To get out Prepare for your home.com Anything you need on your driveway just give Steve Reed a call check us out Everybody, this is Flo back uh, showing you some more right here. The final, we're getting down to the final right here. What we're doing now is we uh, pressure washing this road, getting it clean, getting everything fine tuned so everything can be cleaned up, look nice, so the concrete will lay. Look at that, everything's looking good. Got Scott over there putting our boards in. Got the man right there, Steve Reed. He's not just the owner. He gets out and gets it too. He gets out and works. That's what I love about him. He gets out and works too. Not many people do that. Steve Reed. He's an awesome guy right there. Got Joey over there still forming up the boards. Scott doing the same. But everything's looking good. When we do this with a tractor, it just makes it a little muddy. Yeah, the tractor wheel is getting everything all muddy on the road, so we have to come back and, and pressure wash it, getting it all clean and looking nice. Hey, another thing, we, we, don't want, we want to do this now because once we pour it concrete, we try to do this and splatter all over the concrete. That's why we know what we're doing. That's the man right there, Steve Reed. Prepareforyourhome.com. Preparesforyourhome.com. Check it out. Right, here we go, we've already got this thing ready to pour now. We just washed down the driveway. I've called the dumpster people to come get the dumpster. Got my tractor loaded up, ready to go. This is home maintenance masonry. Let me know. We know what we're doing. We can help you. And I tell you, how we, we, the cleanest road is always never important. I've pulled up on job, jobs where people have done driveways. They've never pressed wash to clean the road. And here's another thing that we've done. I even press wash the gutter. Look how dirty that gutter is. See how dirty the gutter is right there? Well, I've actually cleaned this gutter going this way so that the gutter is a lot, is, is a lot cleaner and it matches the new concrete that we're fixing to pour right here. Another thing I'm going to do when I pour this concrete is I'm going to put an expansion joint right down the middle of the long ways like it going towards the house, vertically and horizontally. When I get through this, what happens is, is if, it, if it ever starts to move, it will move and crack in the control joint because I'm going to make sure that it cracks where I want it to crack. So I'm going to go in to control the crack on it. So it's called a control joint or what's called an expansion joint. If, if, if you're familiar with, with commercial work like I am in residential, uh, commercial work there's a lot more, you have to be even more experienced to do commercial work because there's a lot more regulations and things that you have to go by. Well, the reason why it's because it's important because there's a lot of people uh, that, are in the, that, that basically come in and out of these commercial buildings. So I've take the, I have taken those same techniques and I've used it for residential too because I can make a job last longer. So there we are. We're basically just trying to wrap things up. We're cleaning everything. The homeowners are gone right now, but when they get back, they're going to see that they're going to even see more about that we know what we're doing. Now we pressure washed and cleaned that whole driveway all the way up there to the to the top. We've done a lot of work up there, and now we're finishing up today. But uh, it's very important knowing, what, knowing how to conduct business and doing good business. And uh, 
So another thing she told me she's having problems with was she's got a BMW. Sometimes it bottoms out when she turns it on the driveway. So what I've done is, is I've got a clean cut right there on, on the gutter. That's clean, right? It's a clean, basically, that's all broken off. So when I get ready to pour, I'm actually going to lay these boards down right here. I'm going to pour over to those boards. Right now, I've got them too, stacked too high, but uh, two of them, uh, you know, one on top of the other. But I'm going to stretch them all the way down through there. We're going to pour over to those. And it'll give it a little bit of a lip. But I'm going to do it in such a way that when she turns in here, she turns in here nice and clean and no bobbing out. So we're solving another problem uh, also on top of the other issue where it, already, where it had already been broken up and busted up. So anyway, if you ever need any brick or block or concrete stucco stonework, when I get through this, I'm going to show you a video. You'll see it. It's going to look really, really good when I get through with it. Until then, just keep on watching our videos, and I'm going to show you a final video of this once we kind of get it, uh, uh, get it going and get it poured. Thank you. process of uh, pouring the concrete. It's coming out right now as we speak and uh, we'll have this thing done just right coming. So what we're doing is we're just uh, kind of grazing it, then we're going to be finishing it and uh, making it look real good. So this is kind of how it, how, it, how it goes and we do this all the time. So anyway, if you ever need any repair work, uh, we want you to go to our website repairsforyourhome.com. We'll show you an end result of this once we get through with it. Thanks so much. All right, we're about finished with it. We've got the concrete poured, got the expansion joints cut in it. We got it horizontally and vertically. And all we got to do now is sweep it. So uh, it's looking real good. All this concrete right here is brand smacking new. This is new concrete. We took the old out, we poured new concrete. If you ever need any concrete poured, please give us a call. Look us up on the internet. Go to repairsforyourhome.com. Repairsforyourhome.com. Look at all the services that we provide, and we can help you too. We thank you so much for looking at all our jobs. Thank you so much because we want to help you. Until next time. We'll show you another job down the road. Appreciate y'all very, very much, and goodbye. All right, home maintenance mixer here again. We just got through pouring this entire driveway. We got it looking. I'm talking about awesome. Look at it. This is the finished product of it. And uh, you can see we got the lines cut in it. Come right here. You can see the expansion joint. One of the most important thing about uh, about a job is you gotta have expansion joints. It, it actually looks like a cross. Ha! We're gonna look at it this way. <laughs> we got a cross cut in it, but that's what you need. If you'll notice, this section is about a, this section right here is about a 12 by 12. This section here about a 12 by 12. It's about a 12 by 12 and about a 12 by 12. The most important thing about pouring concrete is you got to have expansion joints about every 12 feet apart. Most people don't put the expansion joints in it, and then it just starts to tear up and start to, just starts to uh, fall apart. So uh, if we put these expansion joints in it, and if people will do that, it'll make the job last a whole lot longer. So uh, uh, this man is very, very happy. We're getting ready now to take these little saw horses over here and put them out here in the, put them out here in the front, and we're going to put some caution tape up and tie it to the mailbox and uh, in a couple of days he'll, he'll, he'll be able to drive on it once it gets a little bit of sun on it. So if you ever need any concrete work done, please go to repairsforyourhome.com and, and, and look at our videos and you'll see all kinds of different work that we've uh, done in the past and we hope that you like all of our work. Until then, God bless you and goodbye. Thank you so much.